really looking forward to the event. Um, I'm particularly interested in the topic. I want to hear from our panel of experts on their thoughts on the causes of the last financial crash, whether we're any safer now than we were six, seven, eight years ago, whether all the regulation that followed the financial crash has actually made any difference at all and made us safer, or whether IT, data management, management of culture, behaviours, uh, could play a bigger role or is playing a bigger role in making us safer. And then I, I really want to hear, there's a couple of guys on the, um, on the panel who are experts in regulatory technology, otherwise known as RegTech, uh, which is sold at the moment as being the silver bullet to many of our regulatory compliance problems. I, I want to find out whether it's as good as everyone claims and what, and what problems it will solve and what difference it will make to the industry. I'm going to be interested in terms of the, the perception of people on the panel, the fact that we're talking about reg tech and the fact that regulation has become an industry in itself, to my mind, suggests that it's become self-defeating. Um, the regulation is something that we aspire to rather than control the industry itself. I'd really like to understand um, what the mood in the room is around fintech and the role that technology plays in allowing institutions to better comply with their regulatory expectations, um, or obligations rather. I think there's so much talk around fintech and regtech as being um, you know, the silver lining on the regulatory cloud, so to speak, and there's no doubt that the costs of compliance have gone, sort of grown exponentially for banks and have become a balance sheet item, but um, I think there's still a bit of scepticism around when firms employ regtech solutions, are they making existing processes cheaper to run or are they actually improving them in terms of what's the regulatory dividend and I'll be quite interested to see what the experience around the room is. You know, I'm under instruction to make this as entertaining as possible so I think this is really really what we're going to do. We're going to try and get it, maybe get some useful information and some interesting opinions and a little bit of debate going but it's all about uh, you know, what's, what do people really think, you know, so let's talk about regulation, how has regulation affected the banks in good ways and bad ways and maybe do that in it with a little bit of entertainment as well. I'm hoping to learn from the rest of my panellists. Um, I'm looking forward to an energetic debate over the use of technology uh, in our markets. Um, it's clearly of the utmost importance to us. Um, it's, it's important to us not only to engage in events like this, but um, to talk to the industry and learn as much as we can and hear the feedback from them as well and uh, hopefully impart some knowledge as well. I've just met all the speakers, they seem great and uh, the subject matter should be interesting. There's lots going on in the markets at the moment. There's some really good examples um, that we've seen in the press uh, at, uh, about systemic risk. So I'm quite looking forward to a nice scene. Uh, so for me it's about open innovation I guess, so we are trying to create a new type of bank, we're looking at the future of what bank is going to be, trying to reinvent banking, but we don't believe we've got all the answers to that, so we're quite keen on the open innovation thing, we deliberately go out there to panel discussions and forums and roundtables to really try and uh, unwrap what banking is and what some of the challenges are and try and share some of our problems and see if anyone else is having the same problems and really try and um, look at things from different angles. I'm, I'm looking for open discussion, I'm looking for a bit of con controversy, I'm looking to have my uh, preconceptions challenged by some very smart people. But I haven't just come here to listen, I'm the moderator. So let's face it, I've got a role to play in actually challenging everything they say. So I'm not going to be taking things at face value. I, I want the panel discussion to be entertaining and interesting and thought provoking. And I want people to go away having enjoyed the evening, but also with some ideas as to what they can do when they get back to their own organisations. So I'm looking forward to having a good heated debate. Another great panel discussion. I, I do think these events are excellent because what they do is they get people to speak openly around some real industry issues in a you know kind of Chatham House rules where, where people can be a lot more open. 
And I think the, the kind of focus on like data, technology, and what's happening in the industry, particularly around like rate regulation, as the theme was today, was, was pretty key. And we sort of focused in on a big topic, which is the importance of data in, in, in regulation. So uh, yeah, very illuminating. Well, I really enjoyed the panel event. Um, the questions were quite thought provoking and uh, a lot of uh, interesting discussions from all the panelists. I liked the fact that there were quite a range of um, panelists from different industries um, and backgrounds which gave quite a lot of different aspects to the discussions. It was a fascinating discussion, really interesting topics raised, uh, interactive response, very interesting panel, particularly on the regulation side and how the regulator seems to be shooting themselves in the foot in many instances, that the regulator is really trying to to appease the concerns from the financial crisis, but it seems to be a lot more form over substance, more check boxes than actual change to the market that, that, that is needed. And I think it's to the detriment of the end user, to the end investor. Um, it's very good, uh, fantastic speakers, getting into a lot of different topics. Coming back to a lot about the crash, but bringing it up to date with a lot more about current technology and regulation and um, yeah, a great evening so far.